Hello adventurers, uh, my name is teacher Eva and today we are going to have our session of early birds uh, and the class on is my world and here with me we have, what is your name? What is your name? Kendi Yes, I have Baraka Kimathi and I have Nina Kendi Mudomi. You're welcome today. Uh, before we begin, we will, would like to have Baraka pray for us. Okay, let's pray. Thank you, Lord, as we start our lesson. Bless us in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Amen. Now we are going to have our adventurous song. We are adventurous. I don't want to love it. We are adventurous. I am every day to be on the time to do with it. It is to end to. We are adventurous. She is a Bani Nambali Sisi Wabuji Nafunya Daina Uwa An Hini Fukuma Asuhu Kujate Sisi Wabuji Now we are going to have our adventurous pledge because Jesus loves me, I will always do my best. The adventurers law, Jesus can help me to be obedient, be pure, be true, be kind, be respectful, be attentive, be helpful, be cheerful, be thoughtful. Be reverend. Amen. And now we are going to have Baraka uh, tell us a story about Jesus' friend Lazarus. Baraka? Our story comes from the book of John 11, 1 to 43. Jesus raises Lazarus. There was a man called Lazarus. He was a friend of Jesus. One day, he became very sick and died. His sisters, Mary and Martha, sent for Jesus. Lazarus was already buried in the tomb. Jesus wept. Jesus wept. Then he prayed to, he, to his God, his Father. Mm -hmm. Then he called out, Lazarus, come out. And Lazarus came out alive. This story teaches us, as Jesus' friends, to believe in him. Amen. Amen. Now we are going to have an activity where the adventurer can have a skipping rope and skip 10 times. We need to see if the adventurer is fit. Uh, Baraka already did it at home, but today he's going to tell us his five friends. Who are your five friends, Baraka? Imani, mm -hmm. Nina, yes. Al, mm -hmm. and then Antonara. And JJ. We have JJ. And Malina and, Man and Manuela. Yes. So Baraka has given us all of his five friends. And with that, you'll have to make a scrapbook. That is, you can have the child either draw a picture or print out. As for Baraka, we printed out his friends. We have uh, Imalina. We have JJ. We have a girl and Nina and also we have so many friends of his. We have Al and Nina there and Baraka also has uh, older friends. 
we have antimora and anko kaka. Kaka. Okay? So you can make a scrapbook at home, something like that. Next activity, we'll have Baraka tell us the Lord's Prayer and he's going to color as per the activity 14 and 15. Baraka, tell us the Lord's Prayer. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on us as it in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive us who trespass against us. Give us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. And as you can see, Baraka already did the coloring on page 14 and page 15 on the Lord's Prayer. And there is also an activity that you also need to you also need to do on page. 26. We need to know if your child knows the world around them. So there it indicates you have the letters and what, uh, the, what the picture, the sound of the picture, the first, the first name. Like here we have a cut, it starts with the sound. So that is C. And Baraka has already done it. We are going to sing a song about God made the whole world including us. God made me. Okay? Okay, let's sing. God made me. God made me. I'm so glad that God made me. God made my fingers. God made my toes. God made my knuckles and God made my nose. God made my heels. God made my cheeks and God made the shape that I am in. God made me. God made me. I'm so glad that God made me. God made me. God made me. I'm so glad that God made me. God made my fingers. God made my toes. God made my knuckles and God made my nose. God made my hippos, God made my chin, and God made my shit that I am in. God made me, God made me, I'm so glad that God made me. Our next activity, we need the adventurer to be able to identify measuring uh, equipment or how big a spoon is, how small a container is. So we are going to do that with Baraka and Nina. And with that, they already did it free. Uh, we, also, we would also like you to do, uh, the adventurer can draw an, a, a picture. In this case, Baraka drew a police car and then we glued with sand and Nina did a bucket. I drew for her the bucket and she glued the beans with the bucket and then they did the clouds, the sun, the moon and the stars. So you can also do the same at home and then remember to take a picture and send to your teacher. So right now we are going to have we're going to have Baraka and Nina do the measuring of sand and beans and be able also to pick the beans out of the sand. Now we are going to have Baraka and Nina try and measure. Then they'll tell us which is a bigger one, which is a bigger container than the other. And Nina. That is okay. Now let's help fill barracas. Come in. Let's, let's fill barracas. We help barracas. 
to fill his container. Hold, pour inside. Uh huh. Now pour it on this side. Now Baraka and Nina, which is a, the bigger container of the two, this one or this one, which was the bigger container, and this is the smaller container. Okay. Now let's let's also scoop some sand and mix with the beans. Okay. Do the scooping, Baraka. Scoop some sand and pour. Nina, here you go. Scoop some sand and pour inside. And then let's mix. That's me. This also helps in identifying the coordination of the child. Okay, now let's try and pick the, the beans inside here. Let's pick the beans and put it here. Let's pick the beans only. Nina, pick the beans only. You see, Mommy. with this, it also helps the child like, be able to identify the different textures and the different shapes of the things that mm. God created. Amen? Mm. It wasn't that fun, Baraka and Nina? Yes! It was fun. <laughs> Thank you, adventurers, for joining us. Until the next time, the next lesson from us, it's goodbye. Goodbye!